Hey Bears fans in Austin, Texas, Mike Fioretti here. We're doing another segment going out to uh, businesses that are owned or operated by Chicagoans. Uh, today, been waiting to do this one for a while. We're going out to Rosati's Pizza in Cedar Park. They just opened a few weeks ago and uh, really excited to get that uh, home pizza taste. I know the closest location that they've had is uh, all the way up in Waco. So it's gonna be uh, pretty cool getting to taste Rosati's for the first time in a long time for me personally. Uh, we're gonna go spend some time with the owners and uh, taste some of their pizza. And we'll see you in a little bit. Uh, follow us uh, on Instagram at ATX Bear Down. Hey, Chicagoans in Austin. I just pulled up to Rosati's, uh, just checking out the place. Um, just looking at the logo, I can already remember how it tastes. Like, I grew up in Marlowe's Park, um, had a lot of friends in Oak Brook, Lombard, Villa Park, Elmhurst, Bensonville, and there was one that we always went to in Elmhurst and one in uh, Lombard. So I, I already know what it's going to taste like even though it's been a while and uh really looking forward to it and uh, we'll be inside in just a couple minutes bear down Okay, Bears fans, uh, in Austin, Texas, this is Mike Fioretti here. I'm with uh, Sean Bartlick. She's the owner of Rosati's here in Cedar Park. Uh, can you tell us a little bit about how long you've been open and uh, what all you're doing here at Rosati's here? Uh, we've been open for about a month now. Um, and we're, we built up our takeout business. We're working on doing the delivery. We've got the dining room part open right now, um, not all the way because of the social distancing and the, uh, the COVID stuff. We're really trying to adhere to that. Um, the bar is open, so you can come in and get a nice hand-picked craft beer. Um, and then we've also got wine as well. Um, and then we've got a beautiful patio for people to sit on. Um, also, with our big screen TVs, uh, if you're a big sports fan, you can come in and watch sports on the TVs, relax, have a beer, sit at the bar, or, or dine in um, at the restaurant. Cool. Um I know that coming in today, I ordered a, a deep dish pizza, uh, an Italian beef sandwich, and uh, you even have gluten-free options. Since you've been open, um, I know you haven't had your grand opening yet because you've been so busy, but what have you noticed some of the biggest sellers have been so far? And um, in terms of, like, I know your deep dish, people from Chicago know this, that it takes a while, um, but can you talk a little bit about what some of your best sellers are and how long should somebody expect to wait on a deep dish pizza order? Sure, yeah, absolutely. Everybody's wanting to try the deep dish, you know, because that's Chicago. Everyone thinks that Chicago pizza is deep dish. Um, when in all, in all reality, the, the thin crust is the Chicago signature. Yeah, um, that, that pizza. pub style, yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Um, and then, of course, cut in squares, you know, that's the Chicago signature as well. Um, the biggest thing is the wait time, because for a, a normal deep dish on a normal day, it takes 45 minutes to cook. On a busy day, it can take an hour, hour 15. We've had a two hour wait. It just really depends on how busy we are. Um, we're popping out those pizzas as fast as we can. If the online, if we get slammed, we're turning off our online ordering so we can fill the orders that we have because we don't want our customers, you know, having to wait longer. We're really trying to work on the, um, the time, getting the time right now for customers so they know how long it's going to be. Yeah, that's... It's a, you know, work in progress, um, but we're dedicated to, my husband and I have owned several businesses, including uh, two other pizza franchises, and we pride ourselves on customer service, quality of food, um, yeah. Yep. And then our, our, chief, our chief Italian beef sandwich is a, a top seller as well. Awesome. And then we have fresh salads. Everything is homemade. Um, we have fresh salads. Um, we have great wings. Yeah, no, really I'm, I'm excited to try it all. Yeah. Now, I know with the pandemic going on, um, I was able to order with no problem on, on the website. 
Um, I know your dining room's not open till four right now because, believe it or not, like I know you've been open what about a month and about a half. A month. Just so absolutely a month. So right at a month today, and you've been so busy, and they're already one of the busiest Rosati's like in the country, and so you want to go make sure you're going to give them enough time. And with COVID going on right now, their their dining room isn't open till around four o'clock, so you can pick it up here. And you can also get that pickup option to go on to the Austin patio and watch a Cubs game if you want to come out and do that. Um, but make sure you prepare for that. But Sean, what would you, what other precautions would you say? Like I, everybody that I've seen or interacted with has had a mask on. What other precautions are is Rosati's taking right now in the pandemic era? Absolutely. So we are. We have a questionnaire that we ask um, our employees if they have any kind of symptoms at all, if they have any kind of symptoms that are sent home immediately. Um, we also do uh, sanitization techniques. We sanitize the pins at the front before and after the customer is getting ready to sign the credit card slip. Um, we've got hand sanitization around the restaurant for customers as well as our um, employees to use. And we have a sign you know, that says everyone is supposed to wear masks. Yep, and I can totally vouch for that. All their, their tables are far apart and uh... No matter what you're, you may read out there, I, I can vouch for it 100%. Everything is being taken very seriously. And I know you work uh, at a hospital also, Sean, so I, I know you're taking it uh, very seriously. Yes, um, so uh, promotions, and um, I know that you're currently offering delivery and uh, pickup, and um, you're doing a coupon system. You have an awesome rewards program. Can you talk a little bit about each one of those? And Sure. Um, so we have a great rewards program with Rosati's. Um, it's through email, so if you give us your email, your name and phone number, we'll send you, you'll get points, you'll build up points for every order that, uh, every time you order, and then you'll get sent in your email coupons for free pizzas, uh, free donuts, just different things like that. We also have coupons that we're handing out um, when people get deliveries, so we're giving them uh, coupons as well, you know, for uh, free delivery and different things like that. We actually did a promotion yesterday for free delivery. I think we're going to do that today as well. So we are trying to um, drum up our, you know, everyone. We want everyone sure. to know that we are delivery as well. So. So make sure you check the website or their Facebook page to see if there are what promotions are being run that day because we don't want to mix anybody up with what's going on. Um, but if you could talk to any Chicago sports fan out there, uh, I mean, I'm about to try their pizza myself. Uh, I know that you've said a lot of Chicagoans have already come in and you haven't had a grand opening. What's a message that you can uh, give on behalf of all the employees here at Rosati's? I know you're a family-owned business. Uh, what do you want to tell all the Chicago fans and Chicago transplants here in Austin, Texas? We are just so grateful and thankful. We are a family-owned business. My husband and I run it. I do work full-time in a hospital, so I am here on weekends and in the evenings. My daughter is my front-of-the-house manager. She also uh, manages the bar. She handpicked all the beer and the wine. Uh, my son also uh, works here as well. Um, and so, you know, we, we care about our customers and we are so extremely grateful for the response, um, overwhelming response, not only from the community, but from the Chicago fans that have been waiting for us to open. It's been absolutely amazing and we are so, so grateful for the support. Opening during a pandemic um, has been hard. You know, trying to do the right thing, trying to adhere to all the guidelines. A lot of restaurants are struggling. So, um, you know, we, we just really appreciate the support. Um, and we, we strive on quality. That is, you know, our number one and then customer service. Um, so, you know, it's a work in progress. Um, we also are doing a wine, half bottle wine night. That's on Wednesday nights. My daughter is in charge of that. Um, happy hour. We also have, you can get single slices as well. Yeah, I saw the deal you got two for six going on right now. Yep. So that's you, pretty good stuff. You can then, get a slice in the soda for $5, which is, and that's an 18 inch pizza, yeah, which is huge. That's a big pie. It is, and that's only cut into six slices. You can also get a slice in a domestic draft for seven bucks. So awesome. you just want to come in and have a slice in a beer and you know, watch some sports, great. And, awesome. Um, we also want to do karaoke night. Uh, we also want to have, you know, we want to have some fun things. We want to be part of this community and give back to the community as well. That's my future goal is to uh, 
support the local uh, high schools, the local schools, you know, charities, things like that. Um, so we will be rolling that out as well once we get everything up and running. And then we also have catering. That is another part that, we'll be, that we will be doing. Again, we haven't got that rolled out. We're just concentrating on the takeout delivery and some of the dining room right now cool. uh, to start. Awesome. Well, Sean, thank you so much for your time. We're going to share your social media pages and your website with everybody. Thanks so much uh, for uh, letting us come out and uh, try your food. I really appreciate your uh, hospitality. Thank you guys so much. We're so happy to be here. Thank you. Hey, Austin Bears fans, again, um, just checked out Rosati's. It is immaculately clean. Um, the pizza's like I remember it. Uh, Sean and her family, they were so welcoming in terms of letting me come in and check their place out, and I can't recommend them enough. Uh, come and see them in Cedar Park. Uh, they're even thinking about opening other locations throughout the course of uh, Austin, so please come and see them. Uh, we're gonna give you all their promos, their Facebook, uh, and in their website, so um, make sure you come and see them. Uh, I know they're super busy right now, but uh, make sure you're you're giving like yourself an hour to uh, to get get your order in for for their deep dish. So make sure you're doing that. Uh, follow us on ATX Bear Down uh, on Instagram. And again, if you're a Chicago owner operated business, we're doing this 100% free because got to find a way to help each other and, and support each other in this crazy time that we're living in right now. So uh, again, Mike, you ready from? Uh, Austin Bears fan club at Rosati's Pizza at Cedar Park. Come and see him. Bear down.